As we as we bid farewell to Kenneth uh, Matiba, as a nation, we need to pick very hard lessons. What happened to Matiba should never happen to any other Kenyan. Matiba stood for the ideals of the poor and the many, and that is why, as a county government, one year and a half down the road, we honoured him when he was alive by setting up a specialised hospital in his name. This is a special eye and dental hospital. And I think he's the only one in the region, and one of the few in the country. And uh, why this uh, was because we know that majority of our people, ordinary Kenyans, suffer high and dental problems in pain at home. And since we started this uh, special edition uh, celebration program, we have treated over 6,000 patients. Today, we are going to treat today on its own 3,000 meaning that by the time this program is over, we shall have uh, attended to uh, in excess of over 10,000 Kenyans. And we are serving Kenyans. We are celebrating as, as a nation, as a county, and I'm calling upon those who haven't come to Ken Matiba for specialized health and dental, free health and dental care. We are free and we are open. If need be, if the numbers will not be manageable, then we are going to, to decide and extend the, 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 the service for a couple of days. Uh, so that we can also, I think, we can officially do it because looking at the numbers, it will not be okay. So we are free and uh, after Kenneth Matiba is ready to rest, we can actually extend the service by about two or three more days.